Hey guys, in this video I'm going to be showing you how to do an Android backup on your HTC HD2 or really any other Android phone that uh, works with Clockwork Mod or uh, the Recovery Mode. So first thing you've got to do is power your, power your device down or if you have an Android ROM that has an option to boot into recovery then you go ahead and do that. So I'm going to go ahead and press reboot. So I'm going to reboot my phone. phone's going to restart and then on the HTC HD2 you're going to have to go into Magloader first so when your device powers on if you've got Magloader installed hold the power key here so hold it when you get to the Magloader screen so then you come up to the options here and you want to go, you're going to want to go down to AD recovery and then press the call button like so this should now boot into Clockwork Recovery. Um, and also you should know that you will need Clockwork Recovery on your phone before you can do this. Um, it's quite a simple thing to do, to install. I'll leave links in the description that tell you how to do that. So remember, first you need Clockwork Recovery on your phone, and then you're able to do this. So Nandroid Backup backs up everything on your phone. Your whole operating system It takes an image of your device, all your settings, all your apps, all your contacts, literally everything. So if anything goes wrong, you can easily revert back to um, one of the backups that you've made. So once you're in Clockwork Recovery, you will see that you have a few options. So what you wanna, you're going to go and do is go down to Backup and Restore. So use the volume keys to do that, to navigate. And then press the Call key here. And that will take you into uh, another three options. So obviously you want to back up so hit the back up key by again hitting the call key and you can see here that uh, the device is backing up now so this is going to take a while I'm just going to cut off the video and come back to you when it's done right now that the backup process is completed you should see um, a little message here it says backup complete it tells you uh, all the things about it how much SD card space you've got stuff like that it tells you what it's done and that's pretty much it for the backup process. Um, you really need, to, if you want to restore, you go through the same procedure. Uh, if you want to restore, you go power off the phone. If you're on a HTC HD2, go into Magloader, go into AD Recovery, into Clockwork Mod, backup restore, and then just press restore. When you hit restore, you will see two options. Well, on my phone, you'll see two options because those are the two restore points I've made. Um, you can make as many as you want, as long as you've got space on your SD card. So you choose the one which which you want to use. So mine would be, I believe, um, oh, uh, the 431 there. Um, as that was the one I've just done then, that's the most recent one. So if I was to uh, restore my device, I would just hit the call key there and that would restore everything and then um, after you had done that you'd hit reboot um, so if you if I did was to press restore now there's not much point because it just uh, just a progress bar comes up and it would complete so really it's pointless me restore, showing you how to restore it but yeah I would press the call key um, once it done you would get to this screen again and you just press the top option there reboot system now it would then reboot and you would uh, be back into the backup that you just made, you'd be back into your ROM again. And one more thing that I'm going to show you is where uh, the backup is located on your SD card. So that way you can free up space on your SD card but still keep your backup by moving it over to the computer. So uh, I'll be back in a sec. Right now I can show you the computer side of things. Um, there are two ways to do this. You can either put your SD card into an SD card reader or you can select uh, the file copy mode from Android, uh, USB mass storage mode. So go onto your Android phone, plug the USB cable into your computer and then turn on USB mass storage. So here you can see there um, it's popped up on my computer which means the device is connected. and all you have to do is go into clockwork mod and you should be able to see two folders backup and download if you go into backup there's the backups you've made the two devices right there two uh, times even 
and uh, just copy those over to your computer. So, yeah, um, that's pretty much it for this video. Um, if you've got any comments or questions, leave them in the comment section below. If you want to see more videos like this, then subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next video.